Hi everyone. Hope you're doing good. It's a rainy day here in North Carolina, but it's gonna be warm. So spring has arrived. It's in the 80s. Um, but anyway, I am working on my stuff from pulling apart two washers yesterday, one old and one very new. And I want to show you something. I'm going to pause and get it ready, and then I'll show you something that is ridiculous. Modern washers. Yeah, we just changed washers uh, in our house. So I thought, okay, I'm taking apart my washer. Not worth it. Modern washers are horrible scrappers in the future. I'm sorry, but um, everything is electronic, and nothing is brass. Um, the timer is electronic. Uh, I don't know if this is it, but this is a, uh, digital switch. All of the knobs had these on them. Solim switches. So, let me pause you, and then I'm coming back. I'll show you what's inside. Okay. So. You can see here, sorry, not in focus, or, uh, frame. The board has probably brass on it, but you can't get that brass off unless you, or and it's gold plated, or it's gold plated. I don't know. I can never tell. But that looks brass. Let me show you. Let me set you up. I think it's stainless, maybe, but it's still too sticky for my yard to accept things like that. So there you go. <sighs> That's what my modern washer had in it, and it was about five years old. And modern washers from China just don't last. Don't buy GE if you can possibly help it. I will talk to you later. I'm working on my, you know, vintage people call their things that they haven't listed on eBay resellers their death pile. Well, let me say I'm working on death pile stuff. Some of this stuff has been here since last summer um, when we moved. So that's my death pile. I'm working on it. Talk to you later, guys.